I want to try temporary hair colour on my natural hair. <laughs> what with L'Oreal Colorista releasing a whole new range of one day, ten day and two week uh, colours or semi-permanent colours, I thought that I would give it a go. So it's kind of a first impressions. So I've got the one day colour in turquoise. My hair is in a Bantu knot out and I simply have, I sprayed water, used a bit of olive oil and then used my shea butter mix at the ends. So that's all I have on my hair. I don't have any gel or anything like that. So we're just going to see how it bonds naturally to my hair. And I've got my vinyl gloves to protect my hands. Put a towel around shoulders, shake well, apply 15 centimeters away from hair. Let dry and brush once. There'll be no brushing here. Spray longer for more intense color. And for a mermaid look, spray different colors on separate strands. So I've only got this one color. Dries quickly, no heavy feel, instant color result visible on all hair types. Okay, you made the claim, I didn't. <laughs> I need to quit, I need to quit, okay. I sprayed a lot. I don't see anything. I sprayed a lot then. I'll give it another go. I can feel it on my ears. I don't see anything. It's on my hands. It's not on my wall, but it's not on my hair either. Do you guys see how much I'm spraying? Nope. Nothing. I'm sure on natural light it'd probably show up, but... No siree bob. Nothing. I sprayed the back of my neck. Just then, I can feel that. There's like the tiniest tinge on my hair. If, if your eyes are good enough and you can see it, it's like the tiniest tinge. Right, I'm gonna spray, like my life depends on it. I'm gonna try and do concentrate pieces and see how that helps. Spray from 15 meters away is no longer an option for ZB. And now it's showing up. Oh, now it's showing up. So it is starting to show up on my hair. It's coming up a lot more royal blue on camera. In real life, it definitely is leaning more towards this turquoise. Oh, keep going. Oh, now it's really showing. Maybe it needs a little while to settle. My idea of doing this kind of like ombre thing has gone <laughs> out the window. I think one of the tips is definitely to spray it for a decent amount of time and then step back and kind of let it settle and then it tends to really show up. two cans of spray which I mean the cans aren't too big and I actually feel like that's more to do with my hair color rather than my hair texture as to why it took me two for it to really become vibrant and show up so I'm not too mad about that though I do wish they would just make the cans a little bit bigger what I absolutely love about this product I have to say is that it hasn't disturbed my set style. I was really concerned that it would make my strands swell and revert and frizz, but it hasn't done that. I've still retained 
all of my curl pattern from my Bantu Knot set, so I'm super, super impressed. And obviously, I get to see what my hair would look like with a fun colour without having to actually lift or dye or bleach my hair. They come in like six colours, I think hot pink, grey, baby pink, lavender, mint, so do let me know if you'd like me to try another one. I'm happy to be your guinea pig to see how it would come up on dark hair. I do actually really love this product. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. Check out my vlog channel, also check out previous videos here. Follow me on social media, it'll be in the description box. I've started a Facebook page that'll house everything for you. Thanks for watching guys, see you on the next one. Bye!